Mr. Wagner, this is Wayne Preston from the Herald. I wonder if I could ask you some questions about the recent deaths at Dante Manor. We're back! It's a private line. How did you get this number? Five deaths within a few months. Quite a sensational story, Mr. Wagner. The public needs to know. We're playing more Lucius. Winter Hill Police Department. This is Senator Charles Wagner. Please put me through to Detective McGuffin. I don't want to break up the cutscenes, but... The press are closing in on this, Mr. Yeah. McGuffin. I have an election coming up, and I can't let this get out of control. I sympathize with you, Mr. Wagner. These journalist types are like vultures around every sad case I get. They just love tragedies. But what can we do? It's a free country. I need to keep this out of the papers, Mr. McGuffin. We've had a run of bad luck. It's as simple as that. The stakes are high, and I'm under a lot of pressure to clear this up. The pressure is on both of us. Your mess is making the precinct look like a joke, and my superiors are not going to take it lightly. Yeah, well, you won't know the half of it unless you get this wrapped up. Is that a threat, Mr. Wagner? That's not something you want to find out. A couple of phone calls can do wonders. Well, damn. Next target. Are we gonna kill Papa? Detective McGuffin. A word with you, please. How did you get in here? You're working the case here at the Wagner estate. No, it's not Papa. I'd like I to confused. ask a few questions about the series of unusual deaths that have occurred over the last few months. Now listen to me. You leave those people alone. They've had some bad luck, is all. They're nice people, and they need space to get over their losses, okay? And if I find you anywhere near this house again, I'll run you in. You got it? Run, Joey! I was almost ready to bring in the Latina maid. I was planning on searching a room, hoping to find a bottle of rat poison or a padlock. <laughs> suddenly, it was too late. Seems that Tom Wagner, brother of Charles, had an affair with two of the maids. I guess one of them found out and wasn't happy about it. Can't really figure out what they saw in that guy. I mean, he was mooching from his brother and doing God knows what in his dirty little film room. When we searched that room, it was a sick pervert's nest. I mean, they had a kid in that house. Little did I know about this kid. Dun, 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 dun. <gasps> we get to kill a pervert now. Let's do it. No, I'm thinking something else also in 77. I was like, what? I thought we were in 77. Now we're in 73. <gasps> no, we aren't. Let's go see what's going on between the maid and Uncle Tom. Am I going the right way? No, I am not. I do like the fact that there is a map in this game. I'm gonna go through this door, take a right. This way. There we go. Who's the other kid? I thought it was just us. Where's Uncle Tom? I don't know where Uncle Tom's. Oh my gosh. I keep hitting. Your uncle yet? No. Oh, that's our room. I literally could have just went into our room, really. Which one of these says Uncle Tom's creepy film room? You are not Uncle Tom's creepy film room. 
Neither are you. Uncle Tom's creepy film room. So it's gotta be around here. Nope. God damn cross. Okay, so we found Uncle Tom's creepy film room. Maybe this is. Have you seen your tea? I'm looking for him. Well, we found the creepy film room. We're just let's just search everywhere. We're we're, we're just going. We just killed one person today. I feel like all of these are creepy Tom's film. Like. Oh. Found Uncle Tom. <laughs> I didn't know. Uncle <laughs> Tom. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, we went where we were supposed to go. We actually did. Where am I going? I don't think I know where I'm going. Okay. So, you are not supposed to enter that room. Turn there. Let's go to Grandpa's study. <laughs> I had to like... Thank goodness they have like long break periods because I had to like stop and just laugh. Okay. Figured out who we killing. Have you seen your tea? Your, your no, where's the study? Let's go back through here. I'm actually curious about something real quick. Seen your uncle yet? Oh no, that's the creepy film room. Never mind. Guest room. Where was it? Grandpa's study, I think. Now where is Gramps' study? Okay. Okay. We need to go over here. So I think we need to go find the stairs. Except I'm going the wrong way. Okay. I am really bad with directions too. This is going to definitely have to be like a want. the hell is you? Are you all right, son? No. I'm a demon child. What do you expect of me? Okay. Yeah. There should be a camera. No. Hello there, boy. Everything God, you sound so creepy, Gramps. Okay. Now where? It's supposed to be somewhere. In that's not all. Have you seen these drawings he made? This is really starting to concern me. Ah, Lucius, I'm just having a chat with your mother. It's just a little rough. Wait, where am I? I think I went too far. Okay. No, don't need the bathroom again. Shh. 
Jason. Hold on. Nope, not in here. Okay, I think we gotta go back to that. I'm really, really dumb when it comes to stuff like this sometimes. Okay. Came over to tell me that, Gramps. Okay. Night stand next to the desk. Okay. Camera fly off. Oh, let's just go back to one. There we go. Okay. I forgot how to combine stuff. Hold on. Okay. Figured out how to do that now. Okay. Okay. Now we have to go get evidence. We gotta go back to the stairs. The stairs are right here. I think this is... Nope. Not the... I was about to say, where's the camera? Shoot. Dang it. Am I on the wrong side? I think I might be on the wrong side. Okay. Give me one second so we could go to correct side. Yeah, we are on the wrong side. So we gotta go this side. Because I'm, I'm serious. Like, why do people need this much room? I, I don't understand. Nope. We're just gonna open all the doors up. <laughs> I don't remember who Susan was. Okay, anyways, gotta go. And now we have creepy pictures of our uncle. <laughs> okay. Where'd she go? How do we give her the picture? Or do we mind control her? Have you seen your Tio? Your Uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? Okay, this is what we gotta do. You're supposed to place it Oh, we're supposed to go back down to her room. Seen your uncle yet? Yes, creepy uncle. Okay, it's one over from her. So then we go here. How do you? What did I do? No, I don't want that. How do I... Supposed to place it in her crap. I think this is her room. How do you place the photo down? Oh my gosh, is this really going to be where I get stuck? Or am I even in the right room? I feel like I might not be. Let's 
grab that real quick. Is this her room? No. Wait, where did... Come, y'all, y'all need names on the board. Like, y'all need names. Hold on. Okay, so I am a dum dum, and I forgot they do this stuff. There we go. Now, time to get rid of everything else because they freaking give you arrows. And then we get rid of the padlock. There. Have you seen your tío, your, your uncle Tom? If you see him, can you let him know that I need to talk to him? Okay. Oh my God! How can he do this to me? There we go. I love how no one's like, hey, are you okay? Why? Oh, why? Can you go to the balcony, woman? I don't know where I'm going. Why? Oh, why? Hold on. Why? Oh, why? There we go. Now I figured out how to do it. <gasps> Weirdly enough. The most clean of them all. That's the bad thing. That's the cleanest kill we've had so far. Okay. So I think we're going to wait for MacGuffin's report. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you guys enjoyed. It seems Bye. we found an obvious culprit in Miss Javita Munez. The missing padlock from the cooler. The rat poison. It almost seems too convenient. Why are you telling me this? It's not like we were close or anything. Well, we have a motive, too. Pictures of you and Susan Myers, and how should we put it delicately, flagrante delicto. It seems your involvements with the staff are a little too tangled. What? I knew nothing about this. You mean she did all this because I had a fling with Susan? Oh my god! What have I done? Tom hasn't done anything. His indiscretions may have led to this, but he would never have put them up to it. There's no reason for it. <sighs> Look, this whole thing is a freaking mess, and I'm trying to put a cap on it. So both of you listen good. Javita was stealing from the house. She poisoned Agnes because she was onto her. We'll ignore all the uh, indiscretions in the report for the sake of your family. Whatever it takes, Detective. We want to put this all behind us. I'll straighten Tom out, but I don't think I'll be able to save my campaign at this point. The press will have a field day. Well, there's nothing I can do about that, Mr. Wagner. But they won't get a story from me. I'm just trying to make a living. We'd finally managed to close the case, or so I thought. Seems like she had been behind every death so far in the house, except the butler. It kept bothering me. Could that really be an accident? Every path we took on the case left me uneasy. Then, right on time, a month later, it happened again. It looked like another suicide. It might have been me who pushed him over the edge. And for that, I am ashamed.